men and women of Barksdale Air Force Base got a chance to show off their skill and dedication to the Air Force's top officer and top enlisted airmen. Chief of Staff of the Air Force Mark Welsh III and Chief Master Sergeant of the Air Force James Cody heard firsthand how these airmen accomplished the mission every day. From General Welsh's perspective, taking care of airmen is how we will continue to accomplish the mission in the future. This people plus pride being equaling performance is really kind of fundamental to who we are as a service. But if we keep recruiting the best people in the country, which we do, if we keep training them better than anybody else trains them, which we do, and if we keep giving them equipment that is at least better than everybody else's, they will continue to be proud of what they do and who they are and how well they represent our Air Force and our nation. And if we do that, we'll be fine. We'll get through all this other stuff. You guys will figure out how to get through it. But if we lose them, if we lose the pride, we're in trouble. So for the Chief and I, that's the focus. It's all about airmen. Developing airmen continues to be the focus of Chief Master Sergeant of the Air Force, Cody, because he believes well-trained and educated airmen are the Air Force's advantage. We'll work through the challenges, the physical challenges that face us immediately. The all-year challenges as we reshape what our Air Force looks like. But the great news is that we have such smart people sitting in this room that they've already been shaping it, will continue to shape it, will be better tomorrow, will be better in the future than we have been in the past. We will still develop our era in a way that the greatest asset any Air Force in the world has ever seen. And that's our advantage today, and we'll remain that advantage in the future. I'm Staff Sergeant Isaac Garden from Barksdale Air Force Base, Louisiana.